All right, hi, it's Heather, and I'm just gonna talk a little bit about proper tensioning for your door area and how you stake out your stout tent. Sometimes over time, if there's too much tension on the zipper, if it's not staked correctly, it can rip the zipper, and that becomes a problem over time. One of the things to keep in mind is usually we want a very tight canvas. It helps with snow shed, with rain shed, and overall just support of the structure. So usually you want that. But in the door, you have to be a little bit careful. It's a little bit different. You have to come from a different angle. If you want to come up here and look at this, basically all you're doing is following your seam line down and then creating a stake out. Okay? You don't want to pull it that way and you don't want to pull it this way. You want to kind of follow your seam line out. And then you don't want to tighten it as much as the rest of your guy lines because you need to have a little bit of flex in this area. You see here, you can come right around here. You can look that the middle zippers here are relaxed enough to come together. Now they're nice and snug, but they aren't straining. You don't see any straining of the fabric here or any straining of the fabric here. If you see straining in your netting, that's an indicator that you're too tight and you're going at the wrong angle off of your guy lines. So just make sure you're checking, if you wanna come up here really close, and check to make sure you don't see any straining in the netting, that's where it's gonna show it first. All right, so you should be able to zip your door down completely, and zip your door down completely, all right? Then you also wanna keep this nice and tight as well. That will help with keeping the overall tent tight, but you do not want to create strain this way. So that's why it's really important to watch the angle of your seam and stake out from the angle of your seam and also don't over tighten this area. All right, so I hope that helps you. If you do that, your tent should last you a really long time. You should have no problem with your zips.